Woke up and uh, made sure my video was posted. We don't have great internet out here. <clears throat> We're at Mulberry. <sighs> this place is beautiful. Love it. I'm sitting here working on the deck of one of these shacks and just watching the sun rise through the trees. I have no idea where Brian is, by the way. <laughs> Found him. <laughs> He's chilling in his tent still. I'm here. He's comfy. Try not to sweat my balls off. Uh, uh, what's our plan for today? We were just talking about it. Let's share it. Um, once I get myself unglued from the Paco pad. Oh, you're... I never gave you the pro tip. The pro tip that I learned is you can never sleep on the Paco pad with no shirt. <laughs> so what next? Go for a ride. All right, whoo, bugs. Guys, this is it. This is it, final ride of Redemption 17. I never thought the day would come. I was hoping it wouldn't, but it is here. And we've got a really good one for you today. You guys like my flamingo gloves? They're loving them. They're pretty cool, I like them. All right. Get moving. Let's get cracking. Ah, oh, the sun's been out today, so hopefully it's dried it up. We have a little bit of a climb. He's making all sorts of noises. I think he's hurting. Yeah, real hurting. Doing wheelie practice on uphills. Must be struggling. Totally. Skirt! It is overgrown. All right, so basically, what's ahead of Brian and I is a whole lot of climbing. And uh, I don't really want to bore you guys with that. So, oh. My lens is dirty. Yep. All right. We're up at the uh, false top on P3. We are in the discussion deciding whether we're actually going to do the entire thing because I am the, the weeks of riding nonstop are really catching up. But we saw that there is a descent right ahead of us. So we're at least going to do that. And then we'll determine from there. We'll, we'll see where we go from there. But let's, let's party. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Brian's first time down this. I don't remember what this is like. Looks like a lot of climbing. Yeah, what? What's going on here? So these trails are not like your average trail system that get maintained by people every week. These are like pretty far out here and I mean, case in point right here. They get maintained by volunteers. So, it's been raining and storming. We don't know what type of gnarly, we've been clearing the trail as we go. We don't know what type of stuff awaits us in front of us. We now know what happens on the way back, which is good. Oh, the narrow path nibbler. And MTB try hard. Back at it again. Woo! <laughs> I'm just getting thwacked. <laughs> Still feeling pretty sore. I'm not feeling like super warmed up at the moment, but this is helping get the blood moving. This trail starts off with just a brutal climb. <laughs> so no real time to like ease into it, which makes it hard. I'm a really slow starter, but once I get into gear, it's on.
I love the sound of those turns. Overgrown! I'm getting thwacked! All right, so judgment call's been made. Uh, we've made it a little bit more than halfway up. And now we get to go down this one. Then we gotta climb a little bit and then we get the best downhill, which is the last one on P3. Oh, they're just itching, brother. <laughs> My biceps. <laughs> These guns are burning. Brian cooking. It's hard to see. Tough switchback. Brian's prepping his bail. I'm a master on the bike. <laughs> Don't doubt my skills. Coming for you, Danny McCaskill. You're nothing. <laughs> wow, you got that. Yep. I don't think I'm going to get it. Yeah. Okay. You got everything today. <laughs> Let's send her. Penhody three. Finale of the Redemption 17 road trip, baby. I hope you guys have been enjoying this because we sure as hell have. Hell yeah. One more for the road. And it's a good one. Brian's riding blind. Whoa, nice dude! That was sick! Fast section here. Fast and kind of blind. It's hard to see with all the leaves. You really gotta be looking ahead. Now we're gonna get into a hard right turn. All right, this is like a straight, wide open section. Scary fast. Keeping my mouth closed to not get bugs. Hard left coming up. Yeah. moments where you just can't see because you get hit in the face with leaves. <laughs> All right, it's the last hurrah. Yeah! I'd like to thank all of my sponsors on Patreon who made this road trip possible for me. I was, I would not have been able to do it. I'm not kidding. After coming off of the uh, injury, woo! you guys have made this possible, not only for you, for me, but for everyone else on YouTube. So thank you for what you're doing. I hope you guys have been enjoying the extended and fun outtakes. Yahoo! Last stretch here. Oh yeah. Fun berm. All right. Oh man, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. That was fun. 
I'll be back in tip top shape in no time. Definitely ready for September. Chasing epic? Yes, sir. When 12 of you guys have the opportunity to come out and ride with me in Crested Butte, none other than Colorado, the best single track in the country. I know I haven't said anything about it on YouTube yet, uh, but now I am. Team up, teaming up with Chase and Epic, late September, four day, most epic mountain bike trip of your life. Ah, I'm not gonna go into the details here. I'll put the link with everything you need to know in the description. Only 12 spots, so don't hesitate. Food included, bikes included, fun included. Everything included, you get there, and everything else is taken care of. I'll see you guys there. Have the beers and bikes ready. <sighs> when I worked here, I, I lived back here. So I spent plenty of time at the, uh, at the pond back here. And generally, there's a couple snakes that like to hang out here on the rock, Let's see if they're there. They're always hard to see. So his head is right. There. You see that? He's underneath that rock. All right, I'm all clean, we're fresh, packing up the car. Moving out. Brian hasn't even left me and he's getting a little reminiscent already. Yeah. No, but Still, for real. Yeah, I'm so happy the way this went. Nobody got hurt. My bike got a little up, but that's how it goes when you're riding. Mine did too, I had to get yeah. the shock rebuilt. Yeah, exactly, and that's what happens, hard miles, and it's fine, it looks good. I'm gonna do some do some stuff, but now I'm curious what our cumulative miles were. I know, I know. I did some Strava. I missed a few things, but uh, it was it was definitely it was a lot. The perfect perfect road trip. I could not have asked for a better redemption run at uh, our attempted or at our attempt last year. Yeah. I mean, and and Alexander started off a little slow, like he was very yeah very cautious and kind of like, oh, I'm not in shape and. He's fine now. Like, we're mixing. I was faster one day. He was faster the other day. I was faster. Like, we're just going back and forth. Like, it, he's he's back for sure. <laughs> I'm back. Still feel like I have some fitness to gain. But I, I definitely, now that Brian mentions that, I hadn't thought about those first days. I hadn't thought about those first days in a while. And I was really struggling. I felt like I was holding everyone back. But um, I'm feeling a lot better now. It's amazing what, uh, like, three weeks of real hard work can do. It's a beautiful thing. Hell yeah. Uh, well, we just developed a really great plan for the rest of the day. I'll tell you about it on the way. Fire it up! It's like three o'clock. We're gonna try to avoid, we're going to Atlanta. I hate Atlanta traffic, it's terrible. So we're gonna spend more time in LJ and Brian remember that he has a $25 gift certificate to, where is it? Uh, Longhorn Steakhouse, I think. Yeah. Longhorn Steakhouse, he's like, you know, I saw one of those in LJ. Why don't we just go there? Yeah. So we're gonna go gorge ourselves on some Longhorn Steakhouse, and then we're gonna do something we've been wanting to do this whole trip, which is go see a movie. The new Wonder Woman movie just came out, so I, I'm pretty stoked to see that. We both like movies. The song isn't on. I can use this, can use this clip. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> oh man, ominous clouds. We just got out of food. It was delicious. We were both Stufferood. Yes, Stufferood is the technical term. Putting Brian to work again. Feeding Sheila. Two dollars and sixteen cents. <sighs> Wait, what? It was like one ninety-eight last. Exactly. Welcome to Georgia. <laughs> they don't even have any windshield s s squeegees. Ah! I feel like Brian gets really mad when we fill up for gas. I'm getting an electric car. Coming down! <laughs> Friggin' lightning out there. Oh wait, I forgot, we're pretty late to the movie, I gotta go. <sighs> Made it back. The movie was good and we're in for the nights. Figuring out the internet for our live stream and uh, Brian's already set up at the workstation. Embassy Suites, you suck. <laughs> premium internet, not so premium. I am personally extremely tired and 
way too full of popcorn. I don't know why I do that to myself every time I go to the movies. I don't know. But uh, I'm looking forward to a good night's sleep. and I still have to figure out what I, where I'm going from tomorrow. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing over the weekend yet. And uh, I know I'm heading back out to Asheville pretty soon after, but... And Brian knows exactly where he's going. Whistler! Yeah. He's pretty tired, too. <laughs> he's all packed up. Rolling out. Literally rolling out. There's the shuttle. I hope he's got a big trunk, because he's going to try to put his bike in it. <laughs> Do you know where that one's from? 40 year old virgin? <laughs> right. All right, Brian, last words. Live free, right on, get stuck. Well, yeah, I mean, obviously. Obviously do that. Yeah. Anything you'd like to tell everyone about the redemption trip as it comes to an end? It's great, it's a great time. Really good riding. Got out of it unscathed, it was fantastic. That I'm was... looking for a shuttle. I ain't taking you nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> well, I want to say thank you, my friends. It was an epic trip. Yes. And uh, you guys better believe we're going to do it again. Just because Redemption 17 is coming, is wrapping up right now, doesn't mean the adventure stops. Brian's going to be adventuring on his channel. I'll be adventuring on my channel. We'll see you guys at both of those. And... Uh, let us, let us know where we should do the next Redemption Road Trip yeah, in the yeah, comments yeah. below. All right, guys. Brian took off for the airport. I'm heading out of the hotel. And that concludes Redemption 17 for now. We've been talking about it a lot, and we think that this was such an amazing success that we'll have to keep doing this. Uh, we'll have to keep the Redemption series alive and well uh, throughout the years. We just love road tripping together and think it's an amazing um, an amazing collaboration and the energy is just so good and you guys the responses were amazing from you guys so thank you for your feedback we're so stoked that you enjoyed it let us know where you think the next redemption road trip should happen should it be in california brian's showing me around should we go to the northeast should we go somewhere we neither of us have been the pacific northwest i don't know but one thing's for certain, just because the road trip with the two of us is on pause does not mean the fun is over. Both of us are gonna be continuing our own adventures on our channels. Brian on BKXC, me here on the single track sampler. Brian's about to go to Whistler, and I'm about to go back to Asheville, I think. I think I'm gonna spend a little bit of time in Asheville and Chattanooga. I'll make a video talking about my exact plans once I figure them out, because I don't really know what they are yet. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. Thanks everyone for watching the Redemption series and being so vocal about how much you loved it. We've loved uh, getting to meet people and go out on rides, talking to everyone in the live streams. Uh, I do think I'll be doing a live stream soon to recap and answer any questions you guys had about the series once you guys have seen everything. I'm like kind of sad that that's coming to an end, but I'm stoked because I know another adventure is about to begin. This in-between period is, is good. You get to reflect on what just happened and look forward to the future. And I'm really, really looking forward to the future. You guys have continued to help this community grow and we are bigger than ever. I think I just hit 35,000 last night. And that is absolutely amazing the possibilities are endless and I just can't wait to continue road tripping, living free, riding hard and getting stoked and bringing you guys along with me. It's a dream come true if I'm being honest. So uh, once again, thank you guys all for being here. Thank you for watching the Redemption series. Um, here I go again on my own. Actually, I'm not really ever going to be going on my own again anymore because I got you guys. And that's pretty rad. Alright. I'll be seeing you guys next week. Just the same as always. Nothing's going to change. New videos every week. I'm going to be doing three videos a week now. Get stoked. 
Uh, I'll see you guys there. Until then, you know what to do. Live free, ride hard, get stoked. We'll see you on the trail.